All right, guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to go over um, some MIDI files and some tips you can use. Uh, specifically, this is good for people who want to do remixes. Um, I'll give you an example. When I wanted to make the Coldplay Viva La Vida remix, now do keep in mind I don't use MIDIs in general. Um, stuff like uh, Gigi D'Agostino, um, it's all done by ear because in many cases it's just a mess using a MIDI file. Um, basically why you would want to use a MIDI file is because if you do listen to MIDI file, it contains the melodies um, separately themselves in, inside of that file. So the structure of the melodies, the bass line, whatnot. So here is, is an example. I have this Coldplay Viva La Vida um, MIDI file, uh, the .mid. If I open that up in FL Studio, so if we go ahead and open it up, <coughs> click accept, Take a second. There we go. You can see that you have um, like this bass here. Basically, you have the structure of the melodies here. Now, why would that be good? Because um, obviously, it does give you the access to the melodies. Now, usually they're off scale. Um, you you have to go in and quantize them or fix them up. Um, but if ever you have the case where you're not getting some of the chords right for a song, or um, you're not getting the patterns right. In that case, it's good because you can take a look at the melodies themselves. And you can also go ahead and add a uh, channel right to it. So if I want to open right here on keyboards, what I can do is right click, replace, uh, throw on Nexus, for example. And I can go to piano, add a piano sound, and we can listen to it. So if I come over here, it's far up over here. You can see that you get the piano sound. So this is just a basic tip on um, using MIDI files in FL Studio. So if you've never known that you can, yes, you can import them in. You can open them up in FL Studio, and it really helps you in, in the case where you, you know, you're not that, that good in terms of doing it by ear. So thanks a lot for watching this tutorial, and I hope to help you guys out with any of your remixes and mixes. Um, if you have any questions, just leave a comment on my video, or you can message me just directly on YouTube. So see you guys again soon.